welcome to Vlogmas. I'm so excited. I'm going to be doing a video every other day. So that's 12 videos in December. Holy fuck. Hello friends. It is Sunday, November 27th. And normally Sundays are my full rest day. But today I did cardio this morning. And I'm about to lift. Because in three days... I'm getting my girls done and that means I'm gonna be out of the gym so I'm trying to like milk I know I'm gonna miss movement so much <sighs> I can't believe it anywho I just made pre-workout I just made two scoops of high volume in sour apple with two scoops of prolific in sour peach the high volume does not have caffeine so if you stack these two together with salt first of all it's the best tasting pre-workout I've literally ever fucking had second of all I've never gotten a better pump than when I take this pre-workout, literally, and everyone I've given it to try agrees on both flavor and pump. Um, Code Val does save you on all PE science, and I've been using them since like 2015, so I really fucking recommend it. But other than that, I am gonna sit my pre-workout on the way to the gym, kill a pool day, and tomorrow we have the pre-op appointment. So tomorrow I'll be getting some blood tests just for them to look over last minute, um, going over finalizing sizing, all the recovery stuff, surgery day procedures, just getting all the questions out of the way, and I'll have Alexis film as much of that as I can. Um, I have a couple friends flying into town a few days after to take care of me. Alexis took off work, so I'm just feeling super fucking supported and excited for this new chapter. Um, and I'll be bringing you guys along it all for the ride. This will be the first video of Vlogmas, so super excited to be doing that. And I genuinely just, I just can't wait. Okay, I'm gonna go hit the gym, and I'll see you guys Probably tomorrow. Good morning, guys. Happy pre-op appointment day. Happy two days out from the girls. I just woke up. I did my check-ins. Body image is still so fucking rough. Like, I really did gain weight so fast. And it's so hard to just see my body like this. But we're growing. We're bulking. The booty is fat. So we, we chug on, okay? Um, I'm about to go pick up Alexis for cardio and then we're going to come back and get ready and go to the pre-op appointment together. Um, but I'm just about to drink my Alphamine. It's my fat burner pre-workout that I drink before every fasted cardio session. I'm obsessed with it. It has L-carnitine so it helps shuttle fatty acids into the mitochondria for beta oxidation which is how your body burns fat for energy. So, code Val. We're going straight to the gym after the pre-op appointment. Um, I'm changing into my gym clothes, but I just wanted to wear something comfortable because I think I have like blood tests and stuff. Um, we're gonna grab some Starbucks and then head to the surgeon and see if we can film. I'm pretty sure we can, but we'll get all the info there. We're gonna finalize the size, just do all the fun stuff. So, two days out. Up. I got a bottle, you got a cup, you hit the duggy. Hello, okay, we're on Rodeo. I have my paperwork from my first appointment. And there's a car coming behind you, like. Good. And we're headed to the appointment. <laughs> Talk to me. Okay, so we're entering, like, I, I guess the medical building. And I forgot what floor we're on. Um, does it say here? Oh, yeah. 305. Yay! I am rolling. Okay, there's literally so many forms for me to fill out, and I'm only like, I don't even think I'm halfway done. So, this is like buying a house, low key. Um, I'm a realtor. Do you need one? Huh? I'm a realtor. Oh, true. <laughs> I'll, I'll I'm selling you a house you right now. House. This is lists with Lex. Yeah. Val's buying her first house right now. Yeah, this is actually It's actually two pieces this is of property. Clickbait. I'm not getting boobs, I'm getting a house. Yeah. Jacket, I size medium essential zip up literally my favorite thing yeah. code bow mm -hmm. oh <laughs> so, I'm trying to make it look cool point is there's a lot of papers but we're done so I'm gonna go turn these in and then see what's next okay this is my blood orders so we're gonna go get my blood drawn it's a couple doors down so go get poked yep. and prodded. <laughs> okay. Hi, how are you? Nope. Nope. Is it really weird that I love getting my blood drawn? Like, I love it. 
No, that's weird. I love it. That it's so weird, so weird, but I love getting my blood drawn. That's so weird. Like okay, when you... I'm gonna need your... Okay, let's step in there. It's the ISO. You are leaning. Those later, I'd have more vascularity, but. So what we're working with. I see like, I like this one's got yeah. 12 yeah, veins over there, yeah. Sensitive visual trigger warning here. Unless you're weird and you like blood like me. <laughs> I, don't, I don't like, I can do all the injections, but not. Oh God, I literally like. Okay, Needles don't bother me, it's just blood. Like veins. I just feel like, I don't know. I don't know what it is. Okay, just keep it like that. Make a fist. I'd rather see you get cut open. Like the actual procedure. Vlog the surgery. <laughs> I would rather <laughs> see the surgery. Thank you. Imagine. Sorry. No. Are you good though? I'm great. You get in there. I know. Oh my god, wait. I haven't gotten my upper lip threaded, so you're probably gonna see. <laughs> okay, I'm going as high. Make sure you get a good swab. You can like blow onto it too, I think. Yeah, yeah. there you go. All right, I think it's good. <laughs> Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's it. Show off the drink. This order's gas. Is that your go-to? Yes. I know how we are about Starbucks, so. Cross your arm and cross your legs. And then just take a few deep breaths back to back. Go ahead and lean back. There we go. It's so real. <laughs> And how, about how much do you weigh? About 115, maybe. Do you have any medical problems we should be aware of? Mm, no. Back looks so jacked right now. Say psych! No, like, really. Let's see the other side. <laughs> yeah, what? He's gonna fall straight and then we'll be on. Okay. Pat it. That's gonna be the cover. The surgeon's about to walk in. Oh god, I'm ripping this, dude. Fit check. Fit code, check. Code Val. Code Val for the surgical gallop. <laughs> oh, does this have strength? Yeah. I guess I do. Oh my god, I'm about to slap somebody. Oh my god, I don't... I don't fit. Look. Oh. Make me snatch. I have to pee so bad. I'm gonna look so much girthier. He's gonna be like, why did you close it? And I'm gonna be like, because of high fashion. Watch him walk in right now. <laughs> oh yeah. Just kidding. Ready? This is extra high profile. 295? That's a pretty solid size actually. That's so small. Small, bro. I have, look at this. I have boob volume. Like, I'm not shredded. Feel that? Put your hand around it. That's bigger than you think, right? Yeah, that's probably. I don't want to go bigger than 330. Yes, but it's not always about how it sticks out. Like, sometimes it's the size of the whole I don't thing. want them to be, I don't want them touching. Mine don't touch. That doesn't change. The way your the profile is, doesn't change. If I get, ooh, my armpit is like cramping. I don't like that. I don't like how they're not turgid. What is this? What is that word? Turgid, like when plant cells become turgid because they have water and it's a healthy plant. What? This is 300, but look at this. This is, when someone talks, uh, welcome. The, the surgeon's gonna be like, I'm not even needed here. Do you see the difference in how they pop up vertically? Yes. That's the difference between their profiles. So this one's extra high profile, so the projection is bigger. Yes, they don't drop as much. They're like, like the same CC, you know, will differ depending on the profile. This one's like wider and flatter, me no want. 
This one's smaller, circular, circular, rounder. This one's gonna need way more, sorry, I'm about to flash you guys. This one's gonna need a bigger implant because this boob, feel it. And now feel this one. It's a huge difference. Wait. Yeah, yeah. It's a huge. That one's smaller. Yes, a lot smaller. I think this one's gonna need like maybe 300 and this one's gonna need like 330, low key. Or even a bigger difference. I'm 375. No, I got 475, 475. Okay, I'm, I'm going small, y'all. I'm 5'5", five, five, 100 and something. All right, I guess now we wait for the docs. See you soon. Watch them walk in. Three, two, one. We were going with the ultra high profile. Yeah, I was like <laughs> circular and round and like uh -huh. on my body, but I still want them like relatively petite. So here's the thing, you can't have both. If you go circular and round, they get bigger. You can't right. be smaller. And no, no, I don't want them smaller at all. I want obviously bigger than my current boob, but I'm not yeah. really getting an. Uh, I'm not getting a breast dog like because I necessarily want them bigger. I'm more about the circular. Like I want them to sit on me and like defy gravity and be super perky. <clears throat> right, um, but they will be bigger because yes. the rounder you go, the bigger yes, they yes, go. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Compared to like the other profile of defense, like the low right. profile. Right, but wouldn't the, the, if we kept the same like CC and we went from like moderate to ultra high, wouldn't the actual like that uh, right? It doesn't work out that way because um, the implants get a little bit too narrow. Um, okay. So as you go up in profile, they uh -huh. get narrower. Right. And if it's too narrow, then you're gonna either have like a really wide gap in between or that you'll have like, um, okay. they'll just move around in your breast okay. too much. Okay. So. <clears throat> Uh, so we said we'd do the ultra high, and then somewhere like in the, uh, we said 325, 350, huh? I don't mind them being separated. I want mm -hmm. them to look like they're sitting on me and like right. perky and stuff. Um, so I'll see, I'll see what kind of fits your okay. frame, you know? Uh, so during surgery, I try out different sizes. Okay. And then I'll see what, um, you know, what works. And here's the thing, I wouldn't stress too much about like 325, 350. The difference is about a millimeter. Or okay. two millimeters. So I'm okay. we're talking about like this much difference. Okay. So it's not like a huge jump mm -hmm. when you go from 325 to 350. Okay. I just definitely want to say like mm -hmm. petite. Yeah. No. I mean, these are. Uh, I mean, with the ultra high profiles, there's a lot. There's a room to go a lot bigger with them. Okay. Uh, so we are uh, picking a smaller size with the ultra high profile okay. implants. Yeah. How much do we think all these medications are going to run me right now? 450. I'm gonna guess like 570. 450. Let's find out. <laughs> But we're in LA. Wait, comment right now. Guess what it is. And whoever guesses it closest to right, I'll do a giveaway <laughs> of a program. Hi. Hi. I'm going to get my prescription. What's that? What is that from Dr. Eugene Kim? And then what you pay for? August 5th, 1999. I'm standing like this because this is my good side. <laughs> you look really pretty. Thanks. It's because this is my good side. Do you have your ID with you? I do. Okay. Now, the so. quality on this phone is actually bomb. I'm so nervous to see. Here, you can. Oh, okay, while we're waiting for our drugs to be ready, <laughs> walking around Rodeo, and I just look so cute. We're gonna get coffee. Absolutely. I see this one was for um, We were both off. Very off. It was 168. I really thought it was gonna be like. Oof, so much. I think mine was like new. I'm trying to put the card that I just put the entire surgery on. I don't even know if it's gonna go through. Oh yeah, I might. Oh, I wonder. Oh. To my credit, we get it. Okay, everything is paid for. Now we just go lift and make the best of our last few workouts. Before a long time. Yeah. I'm really excited though. I'm nervous. <laughs> I'm nervous because we don't have a size finalized because my surgeon, he tries out different sizes using like a, an air sizer when you're on the operating table and he knows what you want. So he makes that decision. So I'm putting a lot of trust in him, but he's like the best rated surgeon in Just all of Yelp. Fantastic reviews and I love all his work. So- I mean, you are in Beverly Hills. Him. Yeah, I really do trust him. So, but it's still a lot of trust to put into somebody to be like, okay, I don't know exactly what is gonna be put in me and we're just gonna, See what you just added. <laughs> and you know me, I don't seize, I don't yield control easily. So, okay, bye. <laughs> really dark lighting, but we are about to make free workout from my Young LA water bottle, code Val. So I got to yell. Then two scoops of high volume in sour apple. Whoa, this that looks so cool. Non stem. 
into this little makeshift table. So it's all about letting other things control today. Yeah, I guess I do got to yield control as I have a drafted email to my surgeon right now. What? I just want him to have more inspo pictures. And I also want to make sure that he knows that I'm okay with going smaller than 300 if that'll give me the look I want. Because I know in, the, in my file right now, we only have 325 to 350. And I was like, you know what? I'm okay with 300. 330. I'm okay with that. <laughs> and then also, I ran out of salt at home. So I stole salt packets from a cafe. This, with my TRBS, we're ready to hit legs. See you soon. Put about to save on the pre-workout stack. That was two scoops of high volume and sour peach prolific. Okay, so it is the night before surgery. I'm probably heading to bed soon. Alexa just got here. This is all her stuff. Um, she basically moved in. She just set up her Xbox in my living room. So we're going to go say hi. Um, I've felt the need to like... One second, let's say hi to Alexis. On my broken TV. This is about to be so bad. <laughs> Hey vlog. Sorry y'all. We got I got this TV two years ago when I moved in with my old roommate, like when I first moved to LA. We got a refund because it was broken and we were meant to throw it away and we just kinda kept using it until we bought a new one. We never bought a new one. Or oh. threw it away. <laughs> this is my my boyfriend. Your boyfriend needs batteries. <laughs> oh no, we don't have any in the house, baby. Boyfriend. Find someone else to take care of me. Boyfriend. <laughs> I am your boy. You can take my car when you're waiting for me to get yeah, batteries for us. Yeah. Okay. Did you get these for me, babe? Yeah. I'm just kidding. Sydney's boyfriend got those for her. No. Okay. So, as I was saying, today, for some reason, like, I've gone to the bathroom, like, number two, every time I've peed, but not sufficiently. Like, I've just had poop ready to go, basically, but I haven't been cleaned out. Like, I didn't have my good morning poop. You know what I mean? You're done. <laughs> You're done. You're done. Anywho, so what I was going to say is I'm going to try to go one last time and I'm really praying for a really good morning poop tomorrow because um, apparently the anesthesia, like it also like sleeps your intestines. So you get really constipated after surgery, like really constipated. It's what I hear. So I'm hoping I get a really good poop because I'm not trying to have like two days of, yeah, feed me spoon poop. <laughs> spoon poop. I'm gonna try to get some sleep. I gotta be up at 5 to take my anti-nausea medication because the procedure Well, we have, I have to be there at 7. So I'll see you guys on surgery day. It feels like show day Like I have to shower my body with dial soap, which is what I have to use before my tans too. So it really does feel like show day. So Surgery day one day out Okay, bye Good morning friends. It is 6 12 a.m. November 30th Just got a text from Meg saying booby day good luck so yeah it's booby day um we're heading out in about 15 minutes alexis looking so cute in her fit okay she literally looks so cute i can't look at her oh i i know every time i look at her boobs i'm like i want those <laughs> And now I'm gonna have them. This is so weird. Anywho, I'm gonna show you a quick little fit check because they told me something that zips in the front, baggy pants, and my surgical bra. So I'm wearing the Young LA. This is my favorite. I wore this into the office and then I washed it because they were like, that's perfect. And I was like, thank God, this is the favorite, my favorite thing probably that I own. So the men's essentials zip up. Um, I have my surgical bra on underneath. It zips in the front. Um, and then the Young LA for her flare wide leg trousers they're so comfy and they just needed something like that they could slip on and off me i'm built like a box so just ignore that but yeah cute i woke up at five to take my nausea medication took that and then surprisingly fell back asleep <laughs> so i'm so excited probably looks so rough right now <laughs> Here we have my chaperone getting in her healthy meal so we don't die. She gets low blood sugar. Easily. Very easily. I'm so excited. I'm so excited too. 
I'm excited because when she's driving and I'm a passenger, this is my good side. I don't have to keep turning like this when I'm being filmed from this side. My good side's the driver's seat, so... Shut up. We're here. We're a little early, so we're just, like, chilling and talking. We just looked at some houses on Beverly Hills. Because, wait, shouldn't... Yeah. Yeah. I, I want to walk in there because I'm like, if I go earlier, do you think they'll start earlier? Like, I'm like, let's go. Let's go. Hi. We're about to walk in. <clears throat> Pre-workout carbs for legs. Oh my gosh. You gotta try a Twix this time. She's never, she's never tried a Twix. No. Last time we were here, I was like, try one right now. But she opted for the Snickers, which honestly, like, respectable choice. But it's only because she hasn't had a Twix. I guess I'll try one. Okay. She's gonna try one and we're gonna go. <laughs> Loose yeah. and stuff. Yeah. Yeah. is very important. You could, you're never too young to do that. Okay. Because people young still get. Okay. okay. Do, do you it. Have your sports bra. Are you wearing? I'm wearing it. Perfect. And this just has my phone. I can just bring it with me. Yes. Yeah. Absolutely. I'll see you later. I'll see you later. Bye. Bye. Love you. Awesome. I've had to film this like five times because I'm like worried that she's gonna come out and I'm gonna be talking. Um, I am here waiting on Val. I dropped her off around seven. It's 11:30. Everybody's texting me, asking me how um, she is, and I, I don't have her yet, but the nurse has called and said that everything went really well, and she's doing really well. So um, we're going to get her. We're going to record every out-of-pocket comment that she has to say while she's drugged up, and we're going to laugh about it. I'm going to laugh about it during. We're going to laugh about it when, we, when she sees this. Um, I got her some snacks from Target and made her a little basket, so she has something to put in her stomach whenever we get back. Um, so I can't believe she did it. Everybody's like, oh my gosh, Belle has, has boobs now. So super excited to see her and I will be sure to get all the clips. So we will see you soon. I got you. <laughs> okay, so just sit your butt in back all the way. Thank you so much. You're welcome. And then I'm gonna put your sleeve belt on and then let's yeah. put the strap over your head. You're welcome. Thank She's you. a little hungry. Make sure she eats right away so okay. she can start taking her pain medication. Um, let's say like in the next couple hours, she should take her pain medication first. Soups and toast, light food. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Bye. Call us if you need anything. Okay. Thank you. Hey. Hi. How do you feel? I miss you. Good. Okay. I'm like, I don't know if it's nausea or hunger because when it's I get weird. hungry, I get nauseous. Yeah. It's normal. Yeah. You're gonna, we're gonna eat. We have snacks at home. Yay. Love you. I love you. <laughs> we're, gonna, we're gonna watch Christmas movies and bake cookies later. We just decided. I'm so excited. We'll see you at home. Okay. I feel a little bit of pressure now, but definitely not like an elephant. Like maybe like a bigger than a chihuahua, yeah. smaller than like a golden retriever. Okay, so I'm in between like blue. Yeah. yeah. You run into neighbors and look like a crackhead. <gasps> I'm so hungry. We have so many snacks. I'm so excited for them. And if there's something you want, I'll go to pavilions. I love you. Love you too. I love the fit. Go bow. <laughs> video you looking at your first look. I haven't seen anything. <laughs> I woke up and I forgot where I was and then I was like <gasps> it's done. Um, the countdown is over. You look so pretty, Sam. You do. Yes. Say hi. I did a hey. <laughs> <laughs> Food porn. My mom like swore she was dying. <laughs> really? Yeah, but she got tummy tuck too. Yeah. Is it good? He's yummy. Um. Let's 
gonna be weird with the light, but. Alexis built me a throne. Yeah, but sure. she's the one who should be sitting in it because she's the queen. No. <laughs> I'm still so hungry, but the nausea, like I can't, and my mouth is so dry. Do I have any more saltines? Yeah, I'll bring them to you. Yay. Let's go get them. Or you don't have I was gonna say an Alexis, but there's literally nobody like her on this planet. <laughs> so if you don't have Alexis in your life, you get a you you get blessed by seeing her in this video, but you don't have her in your life. Because well some of you might if my friends are watching this or her friends. You're missing out. It's the point. I love you. You have you. Mm-hmm. Bro, what do they put in those saltines? It's like it sucks all the liquid out of my mouth. What is salt? <laughs> so, <laughs> saltine. <laughs> GG. Okay, sweet dreams. Bye. All right, guys, I am extremely swollen. I haven't gotten to look at them. It's surgery day at night. I feel like a balloon, but I know this is normal. See how they're looking? They feel huge. I'm like huge. This bra has to stay on for a week until my post drops, so I can't even look at them for a week. I've had literally no pain today, no discomfort. I have not taken any pain, medi pain medications yet, muscle relaxers. Like I haven't taken anything besides my antibiotic, and I feel fine. But I am not gonna like push it. But I feel fine. Also, oh, I don't want to flex just in case. But this is me not flexing pretty lit i look jacked but i also look like a balloon so okay i'm putting this camera down because it's kind of heavy i can't brush my teeth she's gonna do it for me and then i'm gonna take my meds so we thought this would be funny to get on camera <laughs> see how it i've goes. never brushed someone's teeth i want like five kids and i think i just got one this is great she has to literally pull my pants down Ooh, i still haven't felt pain but this one's starting to feel more soreness You can go harder. You're a child, I can't. Harder. Harder, daddy. <laughs> harder. <laughs> Joke. I'm gonna gag Joke you. Joke me. <laughs> Talk a lot of shit. <laughs> I'm not even gonna how this would look. Wait, I think you're covering yourself. Wait, Am camera. I? Hmm. I'm not trying to like it. You want more water? Yeah. I get carried away. I get wet. This is the most sexual. I look so rough. Teeth brushing session. New Ford Health category. Yeah. Tooth brushing. <laughs> Have you ever been toothbrushed before? Dentist. Ooh. I gotta stop. <laughs> Yeah, what are you on right now? Spit. I like a swallow. <laughs> <laughs> How did you not notice? You just know where to spit. Honestly, that might have been, might have been like so in depth, like a good teeth brushing. That felt so bad. So oh. mid. <laughs> Mm, I'll go harder next time. Please. You know it's your do. first time having your teeth brushed, so. Don't take it easy on me. I like it rough. Okay. Man, yeah, that's a wrap. We'll see you guys tomorrow. And I haven't taken painkillers yet. I haven't taken muscle relaxers. I'm going to take a muscle relaxer to go to bed because I slept a lot today. Um, and I don't want to wake up in the middle of the night from pain or anything. And the muscle relaxer will help that as well. Um, I just don't think I have the pain to take a fucking narcotic right now. Like, that's unnecessary. So I'm not going to do that. And then in an a half or an hour, I have to take my next round of antibiotics. So that's where we're at. I'm going to take my diazepam right now. Feeling good. She's feeling good. They're feeling good. 9.15, I'm taking my Valium, my diazepam. And at 10.30, I take my next round of antibiotics.
Good night, love you. Trying to make something work. This is how I was asleep, y'all. I look like I'm about to like host a business meeting. <laughs> She's on a Zoom call. <laughs> Literally, like it might as well be. I will put on a suit and tie and sleep like this too. <laughs> <laughs> Worth it though. Hopefully. Still haven't seen them. We have Still no idea. Know. We literally have no idea. Everyone's like, tell me thanks. I'm like, I would like to see them too. <laughs> That's such a weird giggle. So... <laughs> I'm so nervous. Can I go to bed? Say goodnight. Good night. Good night. Hello friends, so um, it's December 1st, it's the day after surgery. I still have not taken a painkiller. I just took my second round of antibiotics in the middle of the night and I have another one coming up in a few minutes. And I feel fine. Um, there's definitely tightness today, like more tightness, but no pain. Like I said, still no painkillers, no pain. Um, not even really pressure. It's really just tightness and like inability to like feel like I can move my arms. Like I feel like I can't raise them past. So I'm just not gonna try. Um, but I'm gonna go ahead and edit all this footage up until this point and just release the actual breast dog vlog so this video is obviously a vlog and not like a sit down with me let me tell you all about the procedure what I wanted what I got I still haven't seen them myself so it's definitely not a boob reveal I can't wait for that to even happen for me but just hope you guys kind of enjoy me bringing you with bringing y'all with me through the actual like process leading up to the day and the actual day of so I'm super excited to meet the girls and you guys will meet them as soon as I do and yeah, another intuitive eating day for me. I just got a Starbucks, I'll show you my order. Um, I got a grande iced Americano decaf in a venti cup, one pump of chestnut praline, sugary vanilla, and almond milk. And I get extra ice and extra milk um, since I get a grande in a venti cup. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, if you guys wanna see the reveal and just learn a little bit more about the process, have me sit down and talk through it all, then be on the lookout for the next video. But it is December 1st. So welcome to Vlogmas. I'm so excited. I'm going to be doing a video every other day. So that's 12 videos in December. Holy fuck. God knows that I have nothing better to do with my time right now other than work and sit at home. So it's the perfect time to do it. And I'm really excited. So if you guys have video suggestions you guys want to see, I got some like Christmas gift guides coming out, more breast augmentation videos, challenges, vlogs once I'm out and about. It'll be a good time. Like glute growth, transformation videos. Ooh. That movement, it, I felt weird. So I'm gonna shut up now, go rest and edit. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Don't forget to like and comment and subscribe and let me know what else you guys wanna see.